All right, y'all, what's going on? What's going on? All right, so welcome back to sub week day number two. Okay, so today I've got steak escape. Steak escape. If you're new to the channel, please, please, please subscribe to the channel. Please subscribe. Even if you aren't new, if you haven't subscribed, definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. Leave some comments down below. Let us know things you like to see us try, things you like to see us cook, interact with us because we do like to hear from you. I'm going to say grace and get started. Dear Holy Father, thank you for this food I'm about to receive. For the nourishment of our body, health, the Jesus name, I pray. Amen. There go to Bubby. I thought I was going to get through this without him waking up. That's not happening. Hold on, y'all. That was definitely wishful thinking. <laughs> All right, so I've got their... It's basically like some Mexican-style uh, loaded cheese fries or whatever. So it's got some steak in there. And then it's got like jalapenos, pico, cheese sauce, sour cream. And, uh, I think that's it. I don't know if I've ever had this place before. I think this place used to be in one of the malls back home, if I'm not mistaken. But mm. I wasn't a food toothache kind of kid. <laughs> So I got um, a teriyaki steak, I got a barbecue steak, and then I got a, a Cubano one, which is like mustard, Swiss, ham, and I think I got chicken in there. Mm. Mm, break them in half. Things like these in half. Maybe that's just not something that they do. Mm -hmm. Okay. Maybe I should do this before I start it, huh? <laughs> so y'all can kind of see. So like Charlie's. I don't know. I just couldn't like when I seen that. I think I tried to eat Charlie's one time in college. And I seen them take out that sheep chicken. Ah. Mm -mm. Couldn't do it. Mm-hmm. I got my fried chicken bang ranch here. I'm gonna think it's the teriyaki one. Mm-hmm. You can taste that teriyaki flavor right off the bat. Sweet, sweet teriyaki sauce. <clears throat> also, I have a, a wild cherry, excuse me, clear Canadian to drink. Hello. You eat it. This one's really good. Mm. 
<laughs> and I think, I don't even know if I even like Steakums. Like, my dad used to buy them all the time, but. And they loved it, but, like, I just, that was not. I'm a, like, a. I'm a chunk meat type of person, typically. But I have gotten into, like, you know, Philly-style stuff here in my older age. But, oh, this has been okay. Every time I start drinking pop, I get the hiccups. Or, like, right when I drink the pop, I guess my body be like, no, nah, girl. Or, drink anything carbonated, I should say. Mm. What are you doing? Mm. Uh -huh. mm. Mm -hmm. mm. I got the bubby, a little steak one. Um, Off the kids, man, you didn't give him his fries, mm -hmm. though. I did check your bag, and so before I left, I did know that I didn't have his fries. I was like, mm -hmm. I'll just give him some mm -hmm. I said, so it just didn't feel like going back in the store. I was hoping that they was going to do curbside pickup, but I called him and he was like, come on in. I said, oh, come here. Oh, come here. Mm. Now, why can't you keep the bib on, dog? Yeah, I'm talking to you. <coughs> that teriyaki one was good. Yeah, so, like, when I go to, like, Mexican restaurants, like, the places that I call, like, my favorite Mexican restaurants is because they got meat in forms that I like, okay? Like, they got meat, like, chunk chicken, like, places that, sir, I don't want, I don't want nachos with shredded chicken on it. Mm -mm. Unless it's maybe, like, a barbecue, pool barbecue chicken type of nacho deal but like just regular shredded chicken who wants that on that nacho mm -hmm. i want that i also like places that serve like ground beef i like that i don't like shredded i don't typically like shredded beef and it could be just possibly that i've had i haven't had a good experience like unless i'm eating like roast or something like that now that shredded beef and i like it in that form but that's because you know it got a lot of juice it's juicy it's got a lot of flavor but like i know i know the baby i don't like like enchiladas with shredded beef in it mm. shredded beef mm -mm. i don't like it yeah. or let's just say i don't prefer it that way but you know what i'm saying i eat it uh, like this one place we used to go to all the time in Gavin, I would tell them to put chunk chicken, like the fajita chicken, which is like chunks instead of like the shredded chicken and um and his chimichangas or something like that, or quesadilla, quesadillas. Cause that was gross. Yeah. Mm. This is the barbecue one, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty certain. My oldest brother is coming down here this week. Um, 
And I was just thinking, I'm like, what am I do with all these leftover subs I'm going to have in the um, fridge? I mean, I use black pork. Well, yesterday when I ate subs, I did cook something else. So, for dinner, but I imagine most days I'll only, you know, I'll just eat my leftovers later on in the day. Unless it's early enough that I'll try to do another video. I kind of want to, I kind of want to try at least do more than one video in a day so I don't have to record every day. But. Mm hmm we shall see we'll record every day this week I should say <laughs> and he may or may not get on the channel we'll see he still lives in Cleveland so I don't get to see him often. Bad, bad. Ugh, excuse me. Oh. Let me tell y'all, okay? So, in the work fantasy football league, I told y'all I was number one going into the playoffs, okay? Why, oh, why, oh, why, okay? I had to buy the first week of playoffs. And the semifinals, I played somebody. And I beat them last time I played. But, of course, the people on my dang on team, okay? So, you know, I was number one in the league. I think I was number one in points and uh, record, I think. But, uh, yeah, I lost my games. this. I lost this past week. So I think I battled for third, but one and two is gone. And I'm salty. I'm just like, but you, that's just crazy because you just never know, right? You never know. This stuff is so finicky, okay? That's why Calvin was so carefree, okay? He was like, he knew he still had a chance, even if he wasn't number one. If he got a playoff spot, then he would still have a chance to win in the league or whatever. And I bet he didn't even care. I bet you he didn't even care if he didn't win as long as I didn't win. But he won his matchup, so. Saudi, y'all. was so close. But that's okay because... Listen, every year, I keep getting better and better. So, I don't think I made it in the playoffs last year, but I think I battled for, like, fifth or sixth place, and I might have I might have got, like, fifth place, I think. And then, so what is this, my third year? Then the third, the second year, I mean, the first year, I told you I was dead last. So this year I could possibly get third. And hold on, it's not focusing. Yeah, so you know what I'm saying? I'm moving on up. So next year, you know what I'm saying? I'm coming for first, you feel me? Now I may be the commissioner, so I may get to get first. You know, I could do like Calvin be doing. I should email Yahoo this week. Like I think y'all them, you know, y'all need to come up with this fifty point deficit because <laughs> No, it's just, usually my team is really good and they be balling out, man, but all of them was on trash, man. Even A.A. A. Ryan, who usually always gets me like over 30 points. Bro only got me, um... Just over 20 points. Uh, 
I had it wasn't meant for me to be this year. <coughs> Next year though. Now hopefully I'll do way better in the family league next year too. Cause Woo. But I tried to pick some of the same people I had in my work league. My favorite one today was this teriyaki one. It was really good. Or um, I think it's the teriyaki one. What if it was the barbecue one? Mm. No, I think it's the barbecue one. <laughs> I have to put my nose in it. Yeah, maybe that was a barbecue one, and that's that's interesting. And that's why I like it, cause I love barbecue. Barbecue was like my favorite and only condiment that I used to use until I discovered like uh, honey mustard. I'm dibbling, dabbling more in ranch. I've always liked ranch over blue cheese, but I think in my older age, I've definitely like glean towards ranch more and surprisingly I don't even eat barbecue well maybe I'll stay at home as much as I used to but if I go out somewhere I see barbecues anything on the menu I'm likely to get it But Steak Escape is good. I really like it. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. Like I said, I know that we had. Or it was something like this. I want to say it was Steak Escape. I have to ask my brother. I think I asked him that before. Um, but I can't remember what he said. But I'm pretty sure. It was the same place I was in the mall. one of the malls back home but like I said I just wasn't a person I I didn't like steakums I, mm -mm. I told you I tried to try I had tried Charlie's but I'm, I'm thoroughly enjoying this it's really good hmm 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 you sleepy no. You're not sleepy. You sleepy? <laughs> Is you sleeping? Oh, I heard you, Joyce. I seen your comment. I haven't responded yet because I was responding to comments while I was nursing the baby. Then when he went back to sleep, I heard him get up to try and <laughs> get this video done before he woke back up. And he wasn't even asleep 10 minutes. Couldn't have been. I'm gonna look back and see how long I was talking to Yasmin because that's how long he was asleep. It had only been a couple minutes. Um, but she said that she wanted to see. I know you guys would probably like to see the bubby. So one day I do need to figure it out. I'll probably just do like because when um when me, Gavin, and Calvin are all in the video, I do have to move this table up because. It being as close as it is to the wall, typically, it, it, it's not enough space for us all to fit. So I move it back and then I put the camera on a tripod and put that on the floor so that, you know, it could be back further. All I have to say that, uh, oh, excuse me, I'm going to see what I can do about maneuvering so that I can fit the Bubby's high chair on this side of the table. But y'all, that's it and that's all. I am full. I'm very pleased and satisfied. Uh, so again, um, let me know, guys, if you would like me to go to a particular or a specific sub place. I have a list of places. I was going to get another place today. It was actually, I think, a local place, but they didn't do a uh, DoorDash. And not the fact that, I mean, I ended up leaving out the house anyway. But I didn't 
particularly want to leave out the house but I also was like mm, I kind of want to avoid these dang on delivery fees because the fees be crazy um so yeah anywho oh I'll be, I'll be gone gone y'all um let me know if there is a place that you would like me to try this week um yeah like i said i do have a list of places that i had planned on doing but they are not set in stone so i can swip and switch and swap any of them this week. So let me know and with that i'm gonna peace out thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video give it a thumbs up leave some comments down below let us know things you like to see us try things you like to see us cook interact with us because we do like to hear from you and subscribe to the channel go ahead and subscribe hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video and we'll see you in the next one Excuse me, say peace out. Say peace out. He trying, he trying, he trying to put some fingers up. Go, go, go to boobie, go to boobie.